Hey everybody, today we're playing a game called Suits, a business RPG. And this is a game maker game, but it's supposed to be super cool. So I think we're gonna give it a fair shake. I might even try to play all the way through it. It's apparently about three or four hours long. So you won't have to listen to me talk for too long. Although that's the only thing you get from this channel, so I really don't know what you're doing here if that's not what you want. Um, I guess my friends are pretty cool and sometimes you get some of them. But this game was bought for me. Uh, the game retails for 99 cents. Um, and it was bought for me on sale for 60 cents. So I have a policy is if you buy me a game, you get to see it played. So here you go. Slam, 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 okay. Oh, it's a t-shirt factory. Or they make toast? I'm not sure. Yeah, they make toast. Oh no, they make sandwiches, I think. I'm gonna stop guessing. But I was definitely right, it's sandwiches. Nice. This is really cool, like, they drew each individual frame. It looks like with pencil. Welcome to Suit City Business School. Since corporations control our government and society, it's business or bust. Please provide us with your name so that we can make a name tag and get you into the business world, where you get to work. Oh, for the rest of your life, great. Press X to backspace and space to select. All right. I got it, just the guy. The guy is perfect, there's no reason. It's not a name, but whatever floats your boat. It's your default, guys. Make sure you pass this course. If you fail, the suits will have you sent to the factory fields to work the assembly lines. The sandwich assembly lines? Hello, the guy. Welcome to our training course. You may or may not know how to walk. Some suits haven't been fully cooked, so you have to show them how to fall in line. Use the arrow keys to move toward the exit. All right, that's pretty, pretty, pretty standard fare. All right, let's go. Congratulations, you can walk, says Mr. Toots. You're now ready for the next lesson. Walk over to me and press the action key. Space or enter, the button that you've been pushing to advance the dialogue thus far. Yay, you did it. Go talk to your fellow classmates and see what they have to say. Why are they all so small? Old Bill. I want to be just like you when I grow up. Well, you're on the right track. Nick, oh, it's only going to cost me $2,000 to graduate business school. That one hits a little bit close to home. I just graduated and I'm like 50 grand in debt, I think. Not too bad, I guess. Be my daddy. No. Why don't you have faces? Mr. Tit says, if I work hard enough, I could become a CEO. That's awesome. You exist only to work. Never stop working. Work is life. Benjamin, holy shit, that's my name. Benjamin made me a paper hat just for me. Got a paper hat. Press the menu. Let's escape. Let's escape. All right, game maker game. Gotcha. Paper hat is closed. I will equip paper hat. A cheap briefcase, a basic suit, and a basic tie. What does that add? It adds one to my defense. This whole game is in grayscale, but the RPG maker is still trying to just play things in blue for me. Status, I am the guy. What, automatically dash without holding the button? That sounds awesome, let's move faster. Uh, text can be instant, which because at least then I can read it. And battle animations, yeah, show those, all right. Oh, I'm dashing now. Zoop. All right. Yay, you did it. Go talk to your fellow classmates and see what they have to say. But I, I did that. I did that though. But I, but I. Oh wait, yeah. It says oh, okay. Wait, no. I did that. Did it. Did it. All right, I'm out of here. Anna. Mr. Toots, you did it. Uh, I hope you make new friends. The kids seem to love you. You can also interact with many of the objects throughout Suit City. Try it out on that crate over there. When you're done, you can move to the next room. To get there quicker, you can press and hold shift. It's a good exercise. Well, I'm already dashing everywhere. 
June, Anna, May. That's cute. You found a sandwich. Some crates contain useful items, some not so much. No. Alright, cool, whatever. You know, these guys, they worked about as hard on this walk cycle as I did on the walk cycle, and nope. I actually really like it. You just shuffle your feet along. Alright, what's up, guy? I keep hearing strange noises coming from that crack in the wall. I just made a big crack. Hold on, I need to use the water cooler. The finest of jokes are told here. Alright, what do we got? Teacher's office? Door is locked. Alright, well, let's go through the crack. Hey, man, what's up? Mr. Nubs? I'm trying to dig my way out of this secret room for over 15 cycles. I only had my bare hands. Now there's just bare nubs. I'm getting out of here. Nubs kicks over the teacher's office key. Thanks, Nubs. Alright, teacher's office, it is. Um, oh. Alright, there is literally a man right there. Mr. Dudes, hey, how did you get in here? Well, I'm glad you're here. My stapler has been acting up. You think you can take a look at it? Are you going to attack me with your stapler? I can literally attack his stapler. This is the greatest game of all time. Here we go. 32 damage to that stapler. What do I got for text? I can throw my case. I can drop an enemy's defense. All right, well, let's just attack. Suck it, stapler. Suck it, stapler. You're fired! <laughs> Guy got the job done. 100 experience, $100. Promoted to level 2. You did it. You passed the final test of business school. Just remember, some people use tech points. TP recharges as you battle. Others use fuel units. They can only use fuel after being what? Few FU can only be refilled by drinking plenty of water. Now you're ready to graduate. Mr. Toots, congratulations. Class of cycle 404. You're all going to be great businessmen. Me especially, seeing as I'm six feet taller than everyone else. If any of you had parents, I'm sure they would be proud. Lone Renzo. Hey, Teach, I got a call from the CEO. You mean the CEO of the office district? No, not that CEO. Financial? There are three CEOs in Financial District, and I'm one of them. So not the Financial District. No, the supreme CEO of the entire city. Oh, the CEO. He's ordered us to recall this cycle's batch of school children. You might not want to watch this. Oh god. Oh god. Well, you know how it is. It's just business. Can I answer the phone? CEO Roberts. Hello. Is this the guy? Heard you graduated business school. Top of your class. Seeing as my class is vaporized? No problem. We have a job opening for an executive salesman. Looks like it's just been filled by you. Head over to the office district and meet me on the 14th floor to receive your first task. Oh, before I go. I should tell you, you can use these phones to save your progress. Okay. Saved. Hey, what's up, man? How's it going? Dino. Congratulations on graduating. Here's a complimentary water bottle. Don't worry about the price. We'll take it out of your next paycheck. Well, that's complimentary as hell. Uh, liquidate. CEO Lone Renzo. Alright. Well, whatever. Here we are. Hmm. Wait, head up. Wait. Up. Hold on, I think. No. What? You know how it is. It's just business. That's not. So I'm supposed to go to the 14th floor of a different building instead of just going that way? Alright, well. Alright, 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 alright. I'll just go this way. I saw that. Go back. I saw that. <laughs> Office? Uh, no. What is... Laud... Wait. Oh. Financial food. Menu. Alright. Cool. Let's go to the office district. The office district. Keep your nose down, profits up, and your pennies on the horizon. CEO Robert seems like a wise man. Or something. Showers of gold for all, says CEO Roberts. Lisa. Oh, man, that's the last game maker game I played. It's a house. What's up, man? 
Intern T. My brother Johnny lives in the financial district. He's been very successful ever since he got that small loan of, of a million dollars. That's probably fair. You found a hundred dollars. Nothing. Hundred dollars. Hundred dollars. Nothing. Who packs a hundred dollars individually in each crate? It must be the new station. Beware of consumers. All right. Crate is too tall to reach. Well, fine. All right, what about this guy? What's up? Typo. Everyone in these houses are being evicted so that we can all live in the super complex. It's easier to sell products as everyone is in the same place, segregated by demand. Oh, God. Uh, <laughs> um, unfortunately, this means I can never see my family again. But I see I can get a $35 rebate on a new clock. Well, that's not bad. Supplementary food products. $100. Too tall to reach. Jenny. Nothing to see in here. Too tall to reach. All right, good. Job. Napa's district is where all of the big business in Suit City goes down. Well, that's good, I guess. Grass is grayer here. Samantha. Electrocutes you to try to open the door. Salesman. Electronaut. Buy now for only $399.95. Bell. Organization has had a horrible effects on the environment and its wildlife. Oh my job, what is that? Oh, what? The Rat King? Pay your enemy a thousand dollars to lose. All right, well, die Rat King. Whew, I'm lucky he missed. I don't know how bad this guy is. Summons a rat swarm, just punch him to death. I suppose case him to death. There we go. You're fired, Rat King. Got the job done. Found a sandwich. I'm so sorry, Rat King. Bricks. If anybody is reading this, I'm now living on the 52nd floor of the office building. However, we hang out on the roof with my lucky crowbar. What the fuck is this game about? I mean, business, obviously, but like... This is bizarre. Bonus. I swear, kid, if I have to look at you for another second, I'm going to put on 10 pounds of stress weight. He just did. He literally just put on 10 pounds of stress weight. There's something inside of my head. They put something inside of me. Make the ticking stop. Oh, God, he just exploded. Yikes. Stacy. Lacey. Bubba. Unless you're here to deliver the box, I already keep walking. All right, Bubba. Mary. Jane. Yeah, all right. But today's daily catalog purchase, thank you. Monica. There's a terrible smell coming from this house, and it ain't my mom's Alfredo, because the smell would make this one seem like daisies. Bazing. Oh, God. There's a note. If you were reading this, I've killed myself. After playing Castle Gogo 7, I couldn't handle all the foolishness anymore. I thought that they would fix all the issues with the other Castle Go-Go's, but I was wrong. Not even Go-Go Runny Man 3D was that great. It's as if they're only doing it for the money. Whatever you do, don't go into the painting. Some, some talk about gaming as a whole right there, but I don't need to read the note again. Oh, I can make the note go faster, but I have to sit through it again. But yeah, there's a bit of a, a bit of a developer commentary on the gaming industry right there. So we're totally going in that painting. Nothing. Nothing. Found a sandwich. Nothing. Found a sandwich. Nothing. Nothing. Painting. Yeah, I enter the painting. Let's go. What the fuck? Praise go go. You know what this reminds me of? That Mi Plaza that starts when you start your Wii U. Like, you know what I'm talking about, right? Yeah, that thing? That's what this looks like. Oh gosh, praise go go, praise go go, praise go go. All right, oh, let's save our progress. Since we're in a painting, we might as well. Phones work in paintings. Happens all the time. Lasted, aw. Aw, you guys are really sweet. Your faces are kind of fucked up and sideways, but otherwise, you guys are great. I'm just gonna kind of juke you here. Does this go forever? Is this just really long? 
Oh, thank goodness. Hey, Gogo, what's up? I'm Gogo Runny Man, the fastest runner in the land. No relation to Sonic. You must know me from my video game. It was very successful. What didn't you like it? Die! And this game is weird. Alright, Gogo Runny Man. Whoa, he's gonna do me in here. Right, I have one more attack. Yeah, but now I have to heal. There we go. I'm glad not every one of his attacks is as rough as that first one. Otherwise, we'd be in for a bad time. One more. Yep, exactly. Use that sandwich. This is riveting gameplay, folks. Riveting. Attack. One more time. Push our luck. Nope, that's bad. Fuck. Nothing bad happens to me? Huh. Well, that's new. I guess I'm too used to Lisa. Hold on a second here. Clock in. There we go. Alright, let's do this again. This time, I'm gonna be a little bit more... I don't know, free with the healing items and not try to push it. I thought he would be just about ready to die, but there's no real indicator, so I'm gonna just have to play it safe. Here we go. Yeah, you're the fastest runner ever. I don't really like your video games. Oop, I missed. This is off to an amazing start. Now I've fallen. Please get up. Thank you. I'm not doing very well this time. But whatever. I have many sandwiches. Oh, I can use my tech skills, can't I? We got taunt case toss. That was weak. Case toss. My boomerang. There we go. My boomerang case. It does slightly more damage than my melee attacks. Only slightly. Whatever, keep doing it. That's bad. Nope, I got up right away. Never mind. Everything's fine. Last sandwich. We might not be ready to face Gogo Man yet. But I'm gonna keep trying. Nope, not doing well. Go, oh, come on. Yeah, you're fired, Go Go Runny Man. 100 experience points, sandwich found. That was weird. No rewards, no nothing. Just back where we are, back out in the, the world. Which I guess is the world. Kind of bizarre. All right, um, let's go this way then. Hey, there's a plant over here. Cynthia. Hey, what's up, man? Big buy clerk, I got some goods if you have the coin. Buy? I can buy sandwiches, that's cool. Decent briefcase. Better than my old one. Nice suit. X fuel attacks. Nice tie. Pretty tie. Okay, I see. Well, let's take a decent briefcase. I have. I just spent all my money. I'm an idiot. I should really pay more attention. All right, there we go. My attacks are greater. Sell that cheap briefcase. cannot. It's really hard to tell the difference between gray and white, but all right. Uh, okay. My arm fell off. Call emergency services, but I don't have any arms. Medical peers would cost me an arm and a leg. I can't afford that without my arms. Well, a little bit of uh, commentary on healthcare as well. Now we're inside a bike shop. Just hold on. What? Hey, man. I know if you're reading this, then I should have been moved. Best part about it is when they're going to put me in my own special floor. You must really like me. P.S. Don't look through my trash. What in the world is going on? I'm going to follow these tiles. There we go. Hey, trash. What's up? Thing that you can get to come to me? What? 
A thing that you can get to come to me, says Jerome. Well, in that case, let's just use it. Get you to come to me. What in the world? Who the heck knows? Right? Like, this is just random. Okay. Well, not random. It's actually very organized chaos. I'm just going to do this for a second. Hold on. I want to see if this... Does this tile sweep or are we just... Yep. All right. Never mind. Then we figured it out. Off we go. Let's head on up here. Let's save. And honestly, I think that's a perfect time to end the episode. We'll head into the office building and try to find our new job next time.